The BJK Morning Experience on The Rock. 99.9 KISW. 99.9 KISW, The Rock of Seattle. It's the BJ Shea Morning Experience. Greetings, fellow H-holes. I am said BJ. Well, we've got Duff on the show. And, of course, you know Duff, as we said, from Ace of Cakes. And, Duff, uh, there was an article you wrote talking about where you got inspiration. And uh, you, you had said, I certainly did not invent the world of cake sculpture. You said that you were inspired by the late Larry Powell's Big Book of Cake Decorating, which came out back in 1977. And, uh, Duff, I was wondering if you ever had a chance to meet Larry. No. Well, uh, this is, I mean, it's just so bizarre because you're calling Seattle. One of our listeners is actually his daughter, and she was so stoked when she saw that, and, and she wanted to be able to, to pass on some words. So we got her on the line right now. So uh, Jill, who is uh, uh, one of our big listeners from Puyallup, Jill is uh, the daughter of Larry. Jill, you're on with Duff. Go ahead. Hi, Duff. Good morning. Jill, how are you? I'm all right. How are you? Oh, man, this is amazing. I've got to tell you, all right, so I, I, I had to buy your dad's book. On eBay, I paid like three hundred and fifty dollars for it. Wow! And it was like the last like thirty pages. I had like studied and studied and studied and studied. People like you know like nowadays they're like, so why do you like put wood in cakes and why do you build things this way? And I was just like, I, I didn't invent this. Like like dude, this guy was doing it in seventy seven. Like Larry Powell's the man. And it's like, I know. I just I just want you to know how much we appreciate. You given him props for you know for for being the inspiration because that's uh, Dad was always quick to 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 um, remember the people who helped him get his start and not everybody does that and and it's just we really really appreciate it. Oh man, I tell you honestly, like you know you know coming from me, Larry Powell invented what we do. You know it's like you know all of us, me, Mike McCary. I mean you know the, the people that are doing it now that do cake sculpture. I mean we all owe Larry Powell. Everything, everything. Yeah, well, thank we you. learned how to do it at the feet of the the, the the last few pages of that book. I mean, it's really, it's incredible. And it's well, it's so cool to see what what you're doing with it too. You have so much talent, and and you got a lot of heart too. And that's that's pretty cool. Oh, you got you got to have. Yeah, I mean, I mean Larry must have been the, the coolest guy in the universe. I mean, he, just, he was just, amazing. Just, like, he's got such a sense of humor. I mean, like some of the cakes in that book, they say, like it feels like the drunk dude like staggering out. You know, it's just like it's hilarious. <laughs> well, Jill sent us a picture of one of the, the, the cakes that he made. It was an elephant, but it was like a life-size elephant. I was like, this can't be a cake. Holy cow. Dude, Larry was doing this like 30 years before I even thought about doing it, man. Larry is the man. Like, Larry, is, Larry started this whole crazy thing. Dang. So, a point of camera at me. There you go, Jill. Yeah, so. Thank you so much for letting us know about Thank that, you, Jill, because it's really cool, because I knew Duff would appreciate being able to talk to you because I, I, I know how much, you know, it meant to, meant to Duff, that inspiration he got. So, Jill, thanks for being with us. Oh, and thank you. Thanks so hey, much, Jill, guys. We talk to you later. Um, will you send me an email? It's just Duff at TrumpCityCakes.com. We need to talk. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's awesome. uh, that's fantastic. Sure. Uh, make sure we get yeah, it. Sure, yeah, there we go. Yeah. All right, Jill. Thank you so much. Okay. Thanks. There you go. See you, Jill. Well, Bye-bye. And Duff, that, that is really cool, Duff, you know, because... Oh, my God, you guys. That was awesome. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, that guy's like my hero. That guy, he's like, 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 you don't understand. Like, Larry Powell is, the, is, is like, he's the reason. He's, the, he's the, the inspiration behind everything we do, man. I can't believe... Oh, that's so cool, man. So if, if you could, like, today, knowing exactly where you're at and where he was and all the everything that's ever happened, if you could make a cake for that dude right now today, what would it be? Oh, man, for Larry Powell, I'd be, I'd be like, so scared, dude. He's so good, man. It's like, yeah, man, what would I make for Larry Powell? Uh, um... I mean, he already made the life-size version of himself, so I can't do that. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, he made a cake of himself? He got his book. He's, there's a life-size version of himself that he made. It's amazing. Um, so I'm going to make a cake with Larry Powell. I'm going to make him. All right. Oh, man. You know, I'd probably make him a meatloaf. What was that again? I'd probably make him a meatloaf. <laughs> <laughs> Think about it. You know, like, you're know, like you're Larry Everyone's like making a cake, making a cake, making a cake. And you're like, dude, like, can somebody give me like a meatloaf or something? Like, <laughs> something dude. else to eat. <laughs> what if we like now? Would you would you, would you do like a sculpture in a meatloaf? I mean, make it make it that end. You know what? All right, so I'd make a meatloaf. But I'd, I'd, I'd like you know bake the whole thing like slow and long, and then like carve it out like you were carving ice or something like that. I give him like a meatloaf carving. 
<laughs> That's <laughs> awesome. Like, Larry, I know everyone gives you cake, and just like you know, just to, just to show that that like I'm empathetic to his plight, that everyone constantly gives him cake. Here's a meatloaf. <laughs> That's awesome. And it's, it's in the shape of a of a. Uh, King Kong. <laughs> uh, you can definitely tell, though, like, if you really had that presented to you, you would lose some sleep just going, man, I got to do I mean, that's your, that's your hero right there. That's just crazy. Oh, man, I, I can't believe you, son. Yo, that is so cool. Yeah, well, I'll tell you what. I mean, you know, it, uh, we, we were just we we're just happy because she's a she, we we've known her for a long time, and we knew about her dad because she would you know he he made cakes and he there's a picture of him presenting a cake to Leonard Nimoy, and so we knew about it, but we had no idea that in fact he was such a big inspiration to you. And when she told us that, I said, "Oh, we got to put you on with Duff. I know we'd love to talk to you." Oh, uh, Larry is the guy. He is he he started this whole crazy nonsense that we do now. I mean, like Larry started all his fault. <laughs> Like I'm just like this. I'm the, I'm the sort of like the, the worst case scenario of Larry Powell's nightmare. You know what I mean? It's like you know, it's, it's like you know, like the, the where where it's kind of gone and everything. You know, it's, it's it started with Larry and and how he built cakes. He taught us how to use styrofoam, how to use wood, and like how to make it safe and still make it a cake. You know, and like how to make sculpture. Like he was he was teaching us how to do this. And like if you look at the way that we build like our sculpture cakes. It's the same exact way that Larry was doing it. I mean, that's how we learned. It's just like he figured out the right way to do it, and we do it just like he did. So, thank you, man. That was that was. Uh, well, you know how you could thank us. And this is a stupid question, a stupid request, but I'm getting married in a year. Can you make my cake? Oh, here we go. Wow, really? Wow, shameless. Yeah, that's uh, shameless. Yeah, you are kidding, Duff. I'm uh, I'm embarrassed to work with that. Guy. You can make it a meatloaf. You can make it a meatloaf. That's wow. fine. <laughs> Hey, here we are having this like nice country I, I'm like, wow, you guys are so cool. I know. Now you, now you feel right, dirty. Now you owe me a cake. I know, Duff. I, 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 Duff. Uh, one good deed deserves another, don't you guys think? I, hold on. Duff, I would like to apologize for that guy. He's one member who will be fired after today's show, so don't worry about it. I'll download so I had to. I'll go to iTunes right now and buy it. Jesus, really? Times. Really? Hey. You know what? You are such, you are such a New Yorker. Oh, man. That's hey, Duff, we're happy to do it, man, because I think, you know, I, I can't speak for anybody, but if I were Larry, I would be thinking it's so cool what, you know, what your show has done. For for that that art, I mean it's a, it's a, it's a it's a work of art. The what you guys do, and you will put it mainstream. So many people love Ace of Cakes because of it. I think Larry would be like, "This is awesome." I I, I would hope so. You know what I mean? And you know, I talk about Larry all the time. So you know, I I, I hope that that Larry would uh, approve and uh, not like call me one day and be like, "Hey, dude, can you stop dropping my name?" Because <laughs> you know I mean, like, I, I really hope that he's sort of like. You know, he, he, you know, somewhere out there, he's he's he's, he's happy about uh, you know, sort of, you know, how I draw so much inspiration from him, and, and you know, I talk about him all the time because he's, you know, and, and, and outside of the world of, of you know, high end cake decorating, cake sculpture, not a lot of people know who the guy is, and so you know, it's like you know, I talk about him all the time. He's like, whoa, this guy was doing what you were doing much better than you were. 30 years ago, <laughs> you know, he's just like, yeah, he kind of, you know, he was the man. He was, the guy was a genius. You know? Well, uh, Duff, we're, we have to wrap it up, but man, uh, we're, we're happy for your success, and we're happy to be able to hook you up with uh, with Larry's daughter. And of course, uh, don't, don't forget to check out uh, "So I Had to." Uh, it's it's a Duff's new band. They got a new EP on iTunes. Just search for "So I Had to." Uh, it's as simple as that. You'll be able to get on iTunes. Also, you guys got a website and a MySpace page and Facebook and everything. Just just do an internet search for "So I Had to" and put music or band in there. You're going to find it. And uh, Duff, thanks for all the great shows on Ace of Cakes and. And uh, tell Mary Alice, by the way, tell her that there's a guy, an old guy, but a guy who's got a big crush on her here in Seattle. I find that girl so sexy. It's unbelievable. She's, uh, and, 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 and I don't know who I'm watching the show for, the cake or her. I know she's married, but you can tell her that. <laughs> yeah. I'll, 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 you know, I'll pass along the message. <laughs> yeah. I hope, it, I hope it's sure not too will. creepy, but, man, I, mean, I, almost, <laughs> I'm sure I almost, get right to it. I almost get divorced every time God, the show is God. on. <laughs> what a free cake. You want to hook up with my yeah. married manager? I know. Like, it's December 18th. That's when I need the cake by. So just, uh, oh, yeah, Duff. It's too bad because my birthday is December 17th. Perfect. So I'm not going to see. Well, here's the thing. <laughs> yeah. If you could have Mary Alice deliver the cake, then it would be perfect. Yeah. <laughs> like that. <laughs> Actually, have her pop out of the cake. Oh, there you go. Oh, man. Wow, all right. 
That's now that's too far. Hey, Duff, thanks so much for being with us. Okay. Take care. Yeah, I think you're going. All right. Yeah, we, he, had get, he had to get back online. We went too yeah. far. Yeah. yeah. We, 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 I mean, we went too long. I we got say. two beeps. Yeah, we got yeah. two beeps. Yeah. We were gone. Yeah. From those people. He, I didn't realize he was doing a tour. I thought we were just hanging out, so that was my fault. I shouldn't have said that. Oh, hey, what are you going to do? All right. Yeah, not a problem. All right. Yeah, we went as far as we could go. So now, you know what? I can't get mad if other guys are late because, uh, well, we just did that today. Right. There you go. But I mean, he was. I mean, he was really. That was stoked. awesome. He was stoked about Jill. So, and, and yeah, that was pretty awesome. P. Jilly Puyallup. Jill has been a big listener of the show for years, and so uh, I know for her, she's so awesome. Well, her dad yeah, just. I mean, really Larry is. just. He passed away just six months ago. So, oh, really? So it's recent. Oh. So the family is. You know, she said it's left a big hole in their lives. Yeah. Uh, and uh, being, you know, such wow. this great baker and cake decorator and artist. Um, and how about you living with a guy like that? And really, none of us would know about Larry, but because of Duff. Duff has brought notoriety to the to this guy who deserved it because uh, he yeah. inspired you know Duff and it's cool that Duff was like yeah this guy's the man so uh, and he wants to get in touch with her which I think is really cool yeah big time so there you go well, well, that'd be cool if he did like a like a cake for her or something like that I mean there's always those great human interest stories that the Ace of Cakes does you know there's always a great backstory to why they're you know either it be a touching backstory or just like a really interesting one. That'd be kind of sweet. I wouldn't be surprised, Steve, especially yeah. since he's just recently passed away, and and Duff so much seems to really dig the guy. Jesus, yeah. like his voice lit up. Yeah, he spent yeah. over three hundred bucks on eBay for that. It was such a great well, interview until somebody asked him to make a cake for him. What are you talking <laughs> about? What if he said yes? You don't know until you ask. You know, Steve was really throwing it out there because how cool would it be, though? Honestly, right? I mean, I, I get it because that's a move I would pull. But uh, yeah, but I see, really, I, I, I felt like we were doing him a solid. We had a good moment, and yeah. the, the least he it could just, do is return the favor. Oh, what does the guy think? Yeah. Twenty minutes. The to make a is, cake? So New York. What do you think? It's like cake boss. He's not the cake boss. The, you can't make that kind of deal. The with timing him. was He's too better quick. Than the cake boss. It was too soon. You know what I mean? Like up against the touching moment. He, yeah. he didn't really? have the time to set it in. But we only I had like, like seven just, minutes yeah. with these guys. So we got to be acting quick. But I had a strike when the iron's hot. Yeah, I mean, you know, I mean, Steve, I just feel like you know we had such. <laughs> what a if he said yes? That's uh, the worst he could do is say no. By the way, Double R was looking for a flaw. I think this was one of your first flaws. Oh. Whatever. <laughs> you could flaw yourself. Here we go. Sorry, there you go. but uh, you were perfect until that moment. <laughs> could you imagine that? That'd be sweet. Oh, it would be great to have you. Yeah, I'd for charge everybody for a bite of the cake. Uh, but I have make a feeling all the money uh, in the wedding. You know, people pay a lot of yeah. dough to get Duff to make cakes now. I read on his website, I think it's like at least the minimum's a thousand bucks these days because of the popularity of his oh, show. Yeah, hello. It's just like American so Chopper. Make a cake. How, how much do you think it costs? I mean, plus plus if you got on his, you know, all the, I, I think you pay to get on the show and get advertised. Like, no, American Chopper's nothing like a commer- right. but a commercial for anybody who wants a bike made. True, true. Yeah, with the, I went on the Ace of Cakes website or Chomp City Cakes because that's the actual company, and it's funny. Like you go to the frequently asked questions thing, it's like, mm. no, you can't visit us. No, you can't look through the windows. We've we had to like you know dim the windows because too many people were staring in, and plus the camera lights, we needed to have it dimmed down. Uh, but you know, everybody wants to go and visit the shop or have things done, and it's just like we can't. You know, we can't have people around food. Yeah, that's, that's a health code violation, I guess. Yeah, you can't work as in a big terrarium like that, and so I get that. 